All right, you guys, welcome back to the channel. We're here for some more Xenoverse 2, and today we have an absolute top tier character mod. I personally think Dragon Ball Xenoverse 3 should look like this or something close to, but massive thanks to TS Cat for creating their very own version of DB Super Gogeta. I was told that this is basically the character from the DBS Broly movie integrated into Xenoverse 2. How crazy is that? I've seen some clips of the character already and already top tier one of the best gogeta mods out there the combo strings super and ultimate attacks all animations from the movie we have effects as well and just the facial animations the expressions levels above xenoverse 3 this is xenoverse 4 at this point but if you guys are looking forward to this as well please make sure to drop a like on the video i'll greatly appreciate it also a massive thanks to zyko shen for reaching out and sending this character mod over to me i also appreciate that so without further ado let's hop straight into the showcase <laughs> There he is. So we don't have a crazy intro, which is totally fine. But as for the skill set, we do have Super Mad Dance, Spirit Blast, Punisher Shield, and Assault Vanish. Everything does seem pretty basic, but once again, all of the crazy features were integrated into the actual move set. The ultimate attacks, I can't read that, but for the evasive, we do have Punisher Guard and probably some of the new transformations as well so let's start things off with the square combo string all right i think so far the basic gogeta moveset uh, there it is there it is a hey, the clash directly from the movie we even have the crazy snap vanishes oh the clashes <laughs> what the heck oh he is zooming they are zooming oh, <laughs> oh we're not done What was that? Nah, that was it. This is it for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I always appreciate the support. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. <laughs> that was absolutely crazy. I don't know what I just witnessed, man. The entire two-hour movie in just one single combo string right there. <laughs> We are overflowing with power. We are glowing. We just took Broly's most iconic line and stole it for ourselves, man. Oh my gosh. That was only the square combo and the start of the actual cinematic right here. Oh, we get the clash. Look at all the crazy effects that are going on right now. What's this? That part right there. When they're just snap vanishing all over the place into the clash is the coolest ever. Oh, <laughs> we dodged that with some style. <laughs> this is why Gogeta is the best. I thought it ended right there, but no, he goes into uh, Punisher Drive or whatever this attack is called. Stardust Fall. There it is. <laughs> Look how crazy that is. He even flies back, you know, twisting all over the place. <laughs> just like the movie, man. No way! Alright, let's try to break all of that down in photo mode. So we start off with the cool pose right there. Yo, actually shout out to my profile picture. That's literally the pose from my profile picture as well. Of course, I got that from Gogeta himself, but he doesn't mind. Uh, but there it is. We start off with the clash and then... No way, man. Look at that! Look at that! <laughs> Why is this the coolest mod ever? Oh, we're already breaking dimensions out here. Oh, sidestep. So the effect stays on screen. So if we take this into photo mode and move around, it'll stay in place. I think, yeah, I can see some of the characters in the background as well from the film. But look at them just going at it. <laughs> I, th I thought I just saw Gogeta's arm. Uh, I'll go ahead and try to explain what I just saw. But into the elbow, into the kick. And then the explosion, man. Look at this. 
<laughs> I like how once Gogeta is getting ready to use Punisher Drive or Stardust Fall, I keep mixing up the names. He gets that cool energy aura around him. And then we do the backflip, of course. And then we just charge up. That's completely original right there. I don't think I've seen that energy sphere in any other Xenoverse 2 mods. Did you see that? I told y'all, the animations, the facial expressions. Oh, actually, the, the key orb looks like the one from God Punisher. But his jaw, he was definitely screaming for his life. And right here. Wait, wait for it. There it is. Wait, is this like... Oh, no, I thought this was more of a PNG. Because sometimes modders implement different images. But these are actual key blasts, it seems. It has a 3D look to them. There it is, there it is. The full original form of Punisher Shield, or whatever. Oh my gosh. <laughs> and then we just completely obliterate the opponent, man. No way. I don't even know how TS Cat created this. It's extremely smooth and well done, as if the original developers created this themselves. I mean, no glitches, no bugs anywhere, just nothing but pure energy. Peak modding and nothing but pure talent behind this. Massive shout outs to TS Cat. <laughs> With all the different camera angles as well, the zoom ups. Totally unbelievable. <laughs> Let's go ahead and try out the triangle combo string for the one time. <gasps> oh, with the weave. Oh, ooh, hold on. <laughs> so I noticed uh, before the crazy cinematic starts, we do the original Gogeta combo strings, right? So right there. And then we get the crazy cinematic. Uh, I noticed that with the triangle combo as well, it's a lot shorter compared to this combo string. But by far the coolest one so far. Look at that. <laughs> the weaves. Really well animated. All right, so once again with the heavy combo attack. I like how this isn't as long as the first one because the first one is literally just a movie, right? But oh, I like how he just stands there until he gets super close and then just dodges it, breaks his ankles. Look at Broly, man. He stands no chance. I'm still in my base form. <laughs> All right, triangle into the square combo. Let's see what this is. Oh, the twist of ruse. I dropped it. I definitely dropped it. Unless this doesn't have a cinematic to it. Let's try it once more. Triangle, square, triangle, square, triangle. Oh, yeah, so that's it. Mm, let's try that out one more time just to be sure. All right, yeah, so no cinematic for that one. Let's go ahead and try out the grab technique. Nice, nice. Um, what else do we have? The first input of square into triangle. Cool, it's just a knockback. First four inputs of square into triangle. It should be the same combo string. All right, first five inputs of square into triangle. One, two, three, four, five. There it is. Oh, another cinematic. Ooh. He utilizes the Kamehameha technique. No way. I really do like when they implement supers or ultimate attacks within the moveset. <laughs> so that was the first five inputs of square into triangle. Yeah. Oh, I just realized. Yo, that's shout outs to the original DBZ Gogeta. He does the backflip kick attack, right? No way! <laughs> We're resembling or representing both Gogetas today. Ah! But that Kamehameha Blast, I don't recognize it. I don't think it's coming from the movie. Because that wasn't full force Kamehameha, I don't think. 
Um, but yeah, let me know down below where that's from, unless that's just something completely original that TS Cat decided to implement. So I think so far we only have the three cinematics. Comment down below which one is your favorite. I personally think it goes square combo, then the triangle combo, then the first five inputs of square and two triangle. Basically like how I showcased the character in today's video. <laughs> this is the best one, man. I know this is already like our 20th time witnessing this, but it's peak. It's literally peak modding right here. Once more with the triangle combo string, and then we'll go ahead and showcase the actual super attacks. Uh, see with the camera zoom ups, it's I think it's just one camera angle the entire time because usually the camera cuts into a different animation and so on and so forth, right? But this one starts from right there. He dodges it. Oh, I ruined it. <laughs> I ruined it. So let's try it once more. But once again, I don't think there are any cuts. See, it's literally one camera the entire time. It just zooms around the character. As for the super attacks, we have Super Mad Dance. Now, I think these are going to be the original ones. Yep. Super Blast. We still have the transformations, by the way. That's the original one as well. Punisher Shields. Yep. Let's at least do some damage. There it is. Assault Vanish. As for the evasive, Punisher Guard. And... Ultimate attack. Should I transform first? Let's go ahead and transform into Super Saiyan. Let's see how this is. No way! <laughs> oh! Oh! For a minute there, I thought we kept that crazy aura. It was extremely animated for sharp. Sure. I really do like the new feature that modders are trying to implement where they add the actual impact frames from the movie because this looks like Xenoverse 3. I don't even know how Xenoverse 3 originally looks like, but this is it right here. <laughs> All right. Once again, with the camera angle, it's just one, no cuts. I really do like this aura right there. What? Yo, this should be a normal modded aura. And then, of course, we have the crazy one right here. Y'all already know, directly from the movie. And then we power down a little bit. Yeah. All right, let's see if the moveset changed at all. I don't think it is. It's probably going to be the same. Yeah, it's definitely the same. But now as Super Saiyan Gogeta. Cannon! Cannon! This is actually cannon. I just realized. This is uh, the combo and super that he utilized within the Super Saiyan transformation, right? Of course, we were going up against Super Saiyan Broly, not full power, but it is what it is. Stay tuned for part two because I'm going to try to recreate the actual fight. Um, the triangle combo. Oh my gosh, too clean. Too clean. <laughs> <laughs> and the last cinematic right here, the five inputs of Squire into Triangle. Oh my gosh, yo, that was literally DBZ Gogeta. Perfect, perfect. All right, now Super Saiyan Blue. Let's restart and transform again. He is ready! He's ready! Nobody is stronger than Blue Gogeta! <laughs> what the heck? There needs to be a Vegito mod out there directly from the anime. <laughs> if we have those two, then the best fusion character mods ever. <laughs> anyway, anyway, uh, the moveset, I'm sure the moveset is going to be the same, so let's just go ahead and utilize the triangle one just because it is a lot shorter. Oh! It's different! It's different! It's actually different! They literally broke my ankles, man! What? 
<laughs> I decided to use the triangle one because I thought it was going to be the same. And I know I've already showcased the first combo 20 times and a lot of you guys are don't probably want to see that anymore. So that's why I started off with that one. But <laughs> it's totally different. <laughs> the Punisher Shield integrated into the heavy combo no way all right let's break this one down for the one time oh we dropped it ah, stay right where you are broly oh my gosh man what the heck maybe it doesn't work in the air for whatever reason all right we have to try to fix this it might only work on the ground Huh, that's strange. It worked the first time. <laughs> Alright, there it is. Yo, he actually does the aerial twist move. No way. Right here, he leaps forward and then... Dude, the kick. No, and then once again with the impact frame and... He's just done. He's done for. Even even Broly's animation is directly from the movie. <laughs> All right. Now for the square combo. Let's check this out for the one time. Is it going to be different? Oh, it is. Oh, what the heck? No way. That was the best one. The oh, into Comet Strike. We're not finished just yet. This is definitely the best combo streak. No way. Oh, no way. What? Oh, so he doesn't use full force Kamehameha, but that's totally fine. What is this combo string? Why is this the best mod in all of Xenoverse 2? Just my personal opinion. <laughs> but look at that. The start. The fist. Look how animated that is. The background changes in color as well. We get that red energy to it. <laughs> Yo, bro, he's getting beat right now. Ah, no, the damage. It's too great. <laughs> <laughs> Why did Gogeta have to go all out, man? <laughs> this explosion right there? Look at the camera shake. I'm lost for words, man. I don't even know what to say at this point. Shoutouts to TS Cats. That's for dang sure. Oh my gosh, uh, my brain hurts. <laughs> alright, alright, so that was that one. Um, I, I don't want to break it down within photo mode because it would just ruin all the animations and camera angles, right? So it just just letting it play out normally is the best way to showcase this mod. That's 100%. Let's see if we have the third cinematic. Uh, first, let's go ahead and use the first input of square into triangle. Alright, cool. That's directly from Blue Gogeta. First four should be the same. Alright, first five. If there's a third cinematic, it should be this combo string right here. Unless, you know, I'm just bad at the game and drop combos. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, 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 oh. There it is. Yo. Woo. Very straightforward. So he utilizes Spirit Blast. Super attacks. Did they change at all? I don't think so. We have to try them out for the one time, though. Spirit Blast. Punisher Shield. It's crazy how Super Sam Blue has his very own unique combo strings. Um, the ultimates. Now we have the ultimate attacks. All right, so they might have changed from his base form. So let's just go ahead and try these ones out first. Oh, no, no. So this is, of course, from Blue Gogeta. Oh, Stardust Break. Let's go. All right, we have to transform now. We're going to use the triangle ultimate within all transformations and then showcase the square ultimate. See what that is. It's probably going to be full force Kamehameha, I'm pretty sure. Dude, we have to utilize that Super Saiyan Blue transformation 
in the dimension map. I believe, I forgot who created it, but once again, I'll be trying my best to recreate the actual fight, and I'll be including all the different modded maps. It's going to be great. Now this, this is actually canon. Super accurate to the movie. Even the stance, the poses of the supers themselves, right? Now for the square ultimate attack. Oh, all right, all right. I'm glad I did it this way because that's the original Super Kamehameha. It definitely has a different sound design to it though. But there it is. Wait, let's hold on to the input to see if that changes anything. Alright, so that's the same thing. Super Saiyan? Is this going to be a different version of Spirit Blast? Let's see. Alright, so it's still original Super Kamehameha. Super Saiyan Blue! This is it. This has to be full force. I mean, it has to be. There it is! I knew it! No! <laughs> Yo! The camera went around the camera. I'm a hot blast. <laughs> the stardust flick as well. Oh, the turnaround. The disrespect. Oh, what the heck? We got the credits. The end scene. <laughs> the credits, man. Oh. Alright, so we're going to try to include that after the square combo you know trying to make it as accurate as possible so here it is moment of truth meet to your combination into full force the punch is i think definitely the coolest part that one and this one right here um right here that one he even does the pose did you see that <laughs> Interesting, interesting. So, Gogeta has different variants of Super Kamehameha. It just depends on how much key he has. Oh, what the heck? <laughs> it did not work. I tried spamming it. Oh, that's strange. Wait, so it doesn't work? Very, very impressive. Someone at Dimps definitely needs to hire TS Cat for sure. Yeah, so for some reason we can't follow up with full force Kamehameha, but that's totally fine. If we just wait a few seconds, then we're allowed to use it. This is it for today's showcase video. How crazy is this? Let me know down below in the comments. I'm just lost for words. Let's just go ahead and end things off with the actual transformations. <laughs> Show you